Hello Twilighters, we interrupt your regularly scheduled programming to bring you an important guest message. Okay, not really, it's just me, but I'm here to talk about the trailer. Yeah. I did not record my initial reaction to this, unfortunately, because I have forgot. Yeah. It would not have been very interesting to watch it anyway, because I was more overall pleased this time, as opposed to like, oh my gosh, Fen Girl Squee! Fen Girl Squee! Fen Girl Squee! Yeah. That. Happened. Anyway, I loved the first explosion. That was one thing I really liked, because he's standing there, and then, and then Bill of Wrens, and then it's like... <laughs> Also, I call fail on the cheap editing trick they used to make us think that Jacob was there at the same time as Laurent and that he like revealed himself as a first floating young teenager in front of Bella. On first viewing, I have to admit, they tricked me and I thought, oh my gosh, that's how Bella's gonna find out that he's a werewolf and that's not like the book and, and, and oh my gosh, actually that kind of makes sense and cuts down on a lot of pointless lack of plot. Hmm. I have decided that I have a little bit of a problem with Kristen Stewart. Okay, Stu, I love you, but we gotta have a chat because, darling, your lack of emotion is disconcerting. There's a fine line in acting between subtlety and being a block of wood. Oh, that was harsh. Anyway, my point is she's a little bit too sulky for my taste, and I think that sometimes puts a damper on the chemistry between Edward and Bella. I thought it was a little odd how Edward shoved Bella so hard because all of a sudden it's like, paper cut, and Jasper's like, and Edward's like, shazam! Pushing that bitch out of the way. What? I was like, huh. A little harsh there, Eddie Puss. I was glad that they kept the scene where Edward leaves her in the forest because I really like that scene in the book as heartbreaking as it was. However, awkward forest scenes are becoming like a Twilight trademark. It's like, let us stand here awkwardly with our arms locked by our sides and profess our undying love, except not really. Okay! So, sorry that kind of jumped around a bit, was a little crazy, shook you up. But those are my initial thoughts on the uh, trailer. So I'm glad we had a little chance to chat today. You can leave your comments below. And uh, hopefully you will be seeing further guest appearances by me in the future. I love you all and I miss you. Bye-bye.